Predsjednik Svjetske biciklističke federacije Pat McQuaid preuzeo je vodstvo krovne organizacije u vrlo turbulentnim vremenima koja prvenstveno obilježava borba protiv uprabe dopinga. McQuaid je i sam nekada bio aktivni natjecatelj, a danas osim vodstva u UCI-u obnaša i dužnost člana izvršnog odbora Međunarodnog olimpijskog odbora. I went to them to, to speak about our sport, to, to, to tell them what, what's happening in our sport and how it's developing around the world and how, for instance, you know, the, the, the new discipline we brought into, into Beijing, BMX, and what we're discussing with the International Olympic Committee about the future of, of BMX and possibly BMX freestyle and maybe even skateboarding coming in through the UCI. So it was a general discussion on, on the development of cycling around the world. And then also, naturally enough, um, asking them to assist the Federation here in trying to de develop the sport in Croatia and discussing the, the, the possibilities and the, the advantages of first cycling in Croatia. And that uh, since the, it's the all of sport within Croatia is funded by the, by the National Olympic Committee, that they should, they should work closely with, with this Federation because it's a Federation which is doing good work at the moment. Uh, they did they, they took over when there were problems a couple of years ago but now you know the evidence is there to show that the, the membership has gone up the number of races is going up the number of license holders is going up and number of clubs is going up so federations that are doing good work like that need a lot of support but i mean the federation has to do its work and the federation has to be serious about what it's doing come up with strategies work with the clubs support the clubs and likewise the clubs need to support the federation um, and you know develop strategies in the different disciplines because cycling is a, is a complex sport it's not just road racing there's mountain biking there's bmx there's track there's trials there's, um, and so the fact that there are a couple of croatians taking part in the in the world tour races in the big races is a big benefit to, to the sport itself but it's not just that i mean the the croatia is very well placed for, for instance i was up at the race in porridge and i saw a lot of cyclists not just in the race there was 170 odd cyclists in the race but everywhere you went around every road you drove along there were groups of cyclists uh, that have come there for training and um, so croatia is very well placed for to be a base um, for the early season training for most of the northern european countries Um, and that's good for the sport as well and good for developing the sport here. As events take place, major events and, and local events, you've got a very good infrastructure of roads which are quiet from traffic and so organizing races is, is easy here. So from, from the sports point of view, there's huge potential in this country.